So we're getting ready for our day trip today. We're going to Helen. Dad, Dad. That's a pig, yes. <laughs> Should have stayed home, but it's we're, we're, gonna, it. we're gonna try it. Anyway. It will be worth it. We're coming up on a pull off where I'm gonna be able to hopefully get some pretty cool drone footage. Oh, sweet! Nobody's here. All right, perfect. I love this area. Look at the bird. All right, let's get some drone footage.
Ruby Falls was pretty cool. It was very pretty. One of the hardest parts about this time uh, where we're kind of preparing to leave is, is wanting to go see things, wanting to go do things. Hey, shy. <laughs> but you forget about what's in your backyard. Uh, this place is an hour, an hour and a half away. Um, it, it, just because you're getting ready to leave doesn't mean you can't go out and do things. So these short little day trips or weekend trips, taking some vacation time from work, um, just to go local and see what's local, um, that's a, a good way to pass the time while you're preparing to take off. Um, I know me personally and Reagan some as well, we're just... We're itching to get on the road, so, right. but we can't neglect the fact that there's adventure all around us, just right in our backyard. So to get into Anna Ruby Falls, you have to go through the entrance to Unicoi State Park, uh, where you'll have to pay your entrance fee. I think it's about five bucks um, per vehicle. But then when you go to Anna Ruby Falls, it's actually part of the National Forest. So it's $5 per adult. Um, although if you have your national park pass, your access pass, like, like we have, um, you're able to get in for free, which is nice. some animals? Sure. You want to go see some animals? Sure. Try some truffles. Yeah. Which ones do you want to try first? I don't know. Let's, let's lay them out and let's see if we can identify which ones they which are. Ones they are. Yeah. Um, I don't know what this one is, but I'm trying it. Uh, I think, I think it's the hazelnut. Hazelnut, yeah. Yeah. Um, I think this is my lemon. Yeah, I think both of these are your lemon. Or is that one lemon? Hmm. These are Irish cream. Mm, try it. 
What is it? I don't know. Hazelnut, I think. Hazelnut? Okay, yeah. Let Charlie we'll try. Alright, you try that. It's lemon. I believe so. I think that's hazelnut. You wanna try it? I'm not really a fan of nuts. There's not actually nuts in it. Nuts. Okay. Hmm. Is that lemon? Mm. I don't know. <laughs> we it don't know it? what we have. It Wait, tastes actually okay. that's lemon. Alright, that one's gotta be mint. Yeah. That's fancy looking. Yeah. I think this one is lemon. Huh. Wait. No, because this matches that. We got three of one kind that had the same color. We got one lemon. Oh. Is that the mint? Mm hmm. I want just a little bit of the mint. I love mint. Mint and chocolate are meant to go together. <laughs> Some people think that's disgusting. And I think they're disgusting. Mm. This tastes just like one of those Andes mints. It does. Like the, olive, like the ones you this get at Olive lemon. Garden. Yeah. That's lemon. lemon. Oh, that's, that's lemon. lemon. Okay, so these have to be hazelnut then. Yep. Okay. Wow. Oh, yeah. That's lemon. lemon. <laughs> Is it very lemony? Mm-hmm. Mm, okay. Hmm. Did, wait, did try we here, get, try the mint. Did we only get one lemon? Yes. Oh, yeah. okay. See the whole thing? It's all you. I don't really like mint that much. That is very lemony. You're broken. <laughs> <laughs> so, did you like your lemon? I did. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, the lemon was, was actually surprisingly good for a truffle. I've never had That's all yours. Before. You take it. We don't want it. Unfortunately, my family's extremely picky, so. All we have is chocolate. <laughs> we have chocolate and chocolate with walnuts. <laughs> no, we have two blocks. Two blocks of chocolate, of chocolate. and one block of chocolate with walnuts. All right, fun fact. That tastes like good fudge. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's fudge. fudge so it's <laughs> I don't want to say all fudges are created equal because they are definitely not. However. But this is really good fudge. It's good fudge. All right. So. In the end. What is our final verdict? Fudge. What's good? Nine um, out of ten. I think the truffles were a really good thing. I they like were them. my favorite. I love their variety. They the salted so caramel many. was the best, followed by the mint, though. And then my lemon. I mean, but <laughs> um, the ice cream, no, I didn't like It was not that. our favorite. I but am going to say I like the fudge more than the you truffles. You like the fudge more? Yeah. But I, I don't know. I enjoy getting to sample all the different truffles. I like, think that the truffles were good, <laughs> um, but... The Irish cream one honestly ruined me on it. What? What I, I really liked like about that. the truffles was they had such a big variety, and for anyone who didn't, you know, like want the sweet ones, they had uh, they had ones with no sugar in them. That's true. Like, well, they're still sweet, but they just don't have sugar. Yeah, yeah. They're so. just artificially sweetened, <laughs> which is for the birds. For the birds. <laughs> All right. But I think this was really good. I liked it. Good. We should go. We should try to go to Hansel and Gretel more often. I agree. Good call. The drive was far, but... Worth it. Worth it. Thanks for watching our video. Let us know down in the comments what type of videos you'd like to see next.